What's up, gamers? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, gamers? What are you doing? What are you doing, gamers? <laughs> what are you doing, gamers? We're going back into Xanthar in Skyrim. We're gonna find the wall, wall, wall of uh, uh, Alduin's wall, not the wall of Alduin, the Alduin's wall. Even though he doesn't own it technically, so gonna be fighting that. We got we got the whole gang with us. We got Lydia. We got Esbern. We got uh, Delphine. We got everybody with us. Should be solid. And maybe maybe we'll maybe we'll make a little thirty-one today. We'll see. We'll see. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is that just hanging moss hanging out in there? Okay, cool. Alright. I got got my bow equipped, so we're fine there. Let's go. Y'all y'all coming down the they'll, they'll catch up with me. They got it. They're they're adults, but they're NPCs, so gotta gotta keep an eye on them, you know. Okay. I want to discover this little mine or whatever it is. Oh, this is it? A, I believe this is the mine I have to clear out for them. Okay. Now, inventory wise, can we do it? Inventory wise, we can totally do this. Really? Just dodging out of the way. But not that one. Okay. Oh, God, buddy, I'm hating you. I got him. Oh, man. Soldier in large enough, that's acceptable. Okay. Oh! Did you get him, Esbern? Oh man, Esbern, you. Esbern definitely got him. I don't want any of that. Alright, new. Alright, alright. Yep, nope, none of that. Let me get some fast healing in here. Fastly. Eggs. Sorry, y'all. We, we distracted immediately. Xanthar. It's just how he rolls, y'all. I'm not gonna break into somebody's house. All right, let me get. Let me do a war axe right now. Cause I have four here. Okay, yeah. Four here. Wait, is it four? Yep. Okay, so I just need one-handed and uh, archery to upgrade now. Yep, all right. One-handed and archery. This, I don't think this mine's that big. <laughs> yeah, you know, famous last words. Oh, it's not that long of a dungeon. How long could it possibly be? I'm sure it's real short. It's a low mine. Mines in this game don't tend to be very large, except for that one uh, ebony mine in uh, what's my jigger the Dragonborn DLC, right inside the town. I don't even know the name of the town right now. Let me get some. I need... Okay. Do I have a... Uh, 75. Oh, here we go. It worked out well. I don't think we're going to have any problem with enemies right now. Seeing as how many freaking NPCs we got with us. What what kind of mine is... Oh, so I'm mining this stuff, ain't I? Gold ore, baby. Uh, testing, testing. Uh, yeah. I just peaked a little higher a little earlier. Well, maybe if I go down... Yeah, okay. Yeah. If I, if I lean forward too much, get my face into the microphone, it's, uh, peaks a little high, but right here should be fine. Man. Delphine, we'll get there when we get there. Alright. We're gonna, gonna take our merry little time. 
We're gonna mine all the all the ore we want to. We're gonna uh, do as many side quests as we want to. I mean, I already brought y'all there, and I thought you were gonna chill out, but apparently you weren't. Excuse me, gamers. Just gotta gotta get a, gotta get my gamer on in there, you know. I mean, you gotta yawn, you know. Keeps blood flow, you know, and your head cooled off. You know, popped your ears. It's healthy for you. Come on, come on. Mine away, mine away. If I didn't have so many things already favorited, I would. Oh, well, you should you should get your ear checked, dog. Any? No, I don't know that. Anybody? Now you're mine. Dead? Y'all got him yet? Oh, where's my stamina? It's definitely dead. They, they've had to have gotten the other guy by now, haven't they? Yeah, they, they were able to get him. Okay. Okay. Really don't have a lot of stealth, uh, uh, health potions. I think we'll just go without for now. And Delphi? Delphi. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna take extra long and not just equip this pickaxe to wildly flail it around to mine quicker. I'm gonna I'm gonna individually go to each one of these and mine each one of these. Just because you keep telling me to hurry on, Delphi. Just because of that. I can mine when I want to. I can I can leave my NPCs behind. Oh, knapsack. Probably got it already, but you know Xanthar's paranoia. Anything back here? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nope. Come on. Probably nothing. Yep. 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 All right. What is this? Like three or four? Here you go, Delphine. Three or four ore veins for you to stand around watching mine while you tell me to hurry up. Delphine. Oh no, that's uh, Lydia. Lydia. I don't think Lydia's got any better arrows, arrows than uh, iron arrows. I think I just dumped all my iron arrows on her. Yeah, it's fine. She's doing fine. I don't know why. I believe it's. I'm, I've been fooling around, starting to fool around now with uh, Skyrim, because for some reason, when recording Skyrim, and for some reason when I'm recording Skyrim, I get some tearing on the final upload. I don't know what that's about. It's not even tearing. It's just less, it's like little artifacts just left in the in the thing. I don't know. I think it might have something to do with the fact that I don't have motion blur on, but I'm pretty sure it's a YouTube issue because when I look on my actual game, looks fine. When I look on the recording of my game over on OBS, everything looks exactly fine. There's nothing, none of the art, in, oh, if they are there, they're nowhere near as bad as where they are. Yeah, I'm literally, right now, if I wanted to, I could play Skyrim through OBS. Like, that's how good it looks in OBS, right? Yeah. Now, the recording that I get looks as good as OBS does when it comes out. It's just somewhere in between when I upload it to, to YouTube, it's like, ah, let's add, let's add in some little fuzzy squares here and there. and it, it looks like just, you know, 
depixeling. Not depixeling. It just looks like it merging merges pixels, I guess is the best thing I have to say. I don't know. I'll figure it out. I mean, how long could it take to, you know, fix something that's wrong with YouTube, you know? I'm sure. I'm sure it's just good, you know, 20, 30 minute process at most. All right, Lydia, don't pop in front of me this time. You might glitch into the rock. All right, y'all. I think this is the last one. <laughs> I think this is the last one. In this room. Now, we're going to go into another room where there's probably more. This is a gold mine, y'all. Definitely a gold mine. Full on gold mine. Oh, these are two veins? I mean, I ain't complaining. I mean, time wise, I'm complaining, but otherwise, I'm not. Come on, come on, come on, work it, work it, come on, keep, keep, keep mining, keep, there we go, alright, let's go. What's up here? Anything, anybody, anything, anyone? Let's, uh, oh, well you're, uh, do a quick save before we, uh, get our butt beat by you. I think he's gonna go down. Well... While we have the time, let's uh, heal up just a bit, and then uh, see if we can even hit him with a bow from up here, or if we collide with too many things. Well. Okay, all of y'all are just really making everything easier. Okay, well, we tried. We did try. That's how it's done. Is this where we were earlier? I think this is where we were way earlier. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I'll I'll touch. And complain about that, that at all. Oh, well, let's get fast healing out. Yeah, this is. Oh man, this is okay. This is way, way before that. All right. Okay. Yeah, Delphine, we're going back because there's stuff I'm gonna loot, and there's also <laughs> there's also definitely gold still in here. I'm not gonna go into a gold mine and leave gold behind. That'd be walking away from a gold mine. Come on, mine it, mine it, mine it, mine it. Oh god, this takes forever. There we go. Too long. It takes too long to mine this. Let's see. Yeah, at least 13, 12, 13 seconds. That's, that's way too long. Alright, from when I select on it. Okay, so a solid 14 seconds to mine an ore vein. Is that it? Alright, y'all. Uh, this... no. This way, this way, this way. Alright, took care of the gold mine. 
So when I get back to Markarth, next time I'm at Markarth, I can turn that in. Uh, and now, we're going to discover, after smelting, we're going to discover uh, Alduin's wall. Or wall, the wall of Alduin. Yeah, let's just half all our gold inventory weight real quick. I could be using um, Transmutator more often. I'm not really using it right now. I mean, I used it when I first got it just because I was like, oh, let me make some gold real quick. Oh, I wasn't able to. Okay. I do want my bow out for this, though, to begin with. And... I don't want to quick save yet. I don't want to get closer before I quick save. I think I'm going to properly save, not just quick save. Okay, let's... Well... Any more mud crabs? Godly, golly. Mud crabs, such vicious, vicious enemies. I think, yeah, I don't know. Okay. Alright. Are we hidden yet? Are we hidden? We gotta be hidden, right? There we go. Hidden. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. Did I scoot my keyboard over so that doesn't happen again? Okay. It's up there. I'm not interested right now. I mean, I'm interested right now, but Xanther's not going up there right now. Okay. This is where we need to be, and this is a nice little overlook bit right here. Uh, what? Bahu. See, I want to be over there. Let me, let me see if I can get over there. And discover this cave at the same time. See, I'm being, I'm being proactive is really what I'm doing. I'm being both proactive and uh, smart about my sneaky infiltration. That's another... Okay, buddy, buddy. Stay where y'all... Oh, Esbern. Kill shot, kill shot, right into what I would assume is his nipple. But, you know. Oh, okay, I didn't know this was so close. Interesting. Take that. Yep, 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 yep. That's all I want from you. Oh, I want some. Anything over there? I don't know, I mean. Looks like it might be some potions right there. Yep, potions. We're not getting it, it's iron ore. <laughs> We're not getting it. We're not interested in, 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 it, in it right now. Alright, where am I here? Okay. So from here... From here I should be able to uh, parkour my way. And take out this uh, hag raven. Oh, okay. So there's... Uh, I can't even see the hag from here. Okay. Hopefully they're not following me, or if they are, they're following me at a distance. Okay. Oh dear God, Lydia, you had to spawn in right there, didn't you? <laughs> okay, let's see. We got ten. It's magic. I don't want that. Uh, is that the so ten? Yeah, that's all I got for po poison. Hold still. Oh, of course not. Of course not. Damn hag. Come on. I'm gonna 
us there, you raven of hag. Oh, gosh, she's gonna keep healing, ain't she? Well. Come on, y'all. Nope. Got their soul, or her soul. Are Hag Ravens gendered? If they're all witches, or they're all if they're all hags, does that mean Hag Ravens are gendered, or does it just mean? I need nice shot. I assume Lydia. Oh. They're just throwing soul. Gen I mean, I guess because I picked up a feat or a skill in it chest oh, unlocked and everything oh well I mean I have the enchantment I have that enchantment but cash money y'all septum money oh is that I can't okay it's nothing Yeah. Alright. Alright, who wants some? Let me start with the bow just in case. There's anyone fair oof or anyone not close. Where is everybody? I mean I got red dots, but I ain't got I mean, oh Esbern's coming all the way. I mean, you can see which way Esbern's coming from because his uh his thing. Going nice so far. Uh, I just didn't want to pick up your sword. Here, here, here's your sword back here. Oh, oh Lydia! I was like, who, who are you yelling at? I thought Lydia was yelling at somebody behind me. I hear Nern roots somewhere. What the? Oh, this is a this is a enemy antiar. Uh, antiar. Okay. I wish they'd be like, oh, you know, Forsworn Looters, you know, summoned creature, instead of just like, oh, there's a summoned creature. Oh, that's plentiful. This is what I need. Right. How do I get back up? Is there not a ramp? I gotta be able to get back up here, right? Oh man, they made this, they made the, oh, they really screwed you over if you fell, fell down here. You guys, guess you gotta come all the way back here. L Lydia. Okay, gold. Okay, is that it? Is that everybody in this little camp? This weed little camp? Oh, I'll take that. And that's it I'll be taking out of here. Oh, what is that? Storker's Grave Sword. But who's. Oh, I bet you there's somebody up, up there that I didn't get on that platform. Well, they can wait. They can wait. <laughs> they can wait for me to loot the rest of their camp. If they really cared about the rest of their camp, they'd be running down here to stop me from looting it. Nice! Block skill. Nothing. 
No, I can just pointless food. Oh, well, person to loot. And leather strips. Nice. Hey, Lydia, what's your bow at? Because this is, what is this, 20? No, I think she's got, I think she's got better than 21. She's got to have better than 21 damage, I bet you. Ooh, gold, gold, gold. See Skyrim, just a little, little gold pouch. Nobody needs these piles of individual itemized coins to pick up. It's just not worth it. Not worth it. I mean, it doesn't mean I'm not going to pick up gold coins in this game, but it means it's... Okay. Okay, y'all. All right. And that is one really good strategy to uh, level up. Oh, danger heart. To level up your restoration is just either have a really good uh, companion who's doing combat and you know only give them melee weapons or have a couple of them with you and conjuration helps with this too um and then just get your shield out <laughs> get your restoration spell or whatever magic you want to increase and uh let the melee begin as you uh use your shield and whatever magic you're using i can survive this right yeah easy peasy easy peasy okay Man, force one up here. I'm not gonna get. That. I think there's one more, but we'll leave their body unlooted. Just one. Okay. Karth Spire. Let's go find Alduin's wall, or the wall of Alduin. Y'all up here. Y'all. Y'all. Esber and Delphine. Y'all don't sneak whatsoever. I mean, Esber, for as much as you were, you know. In the rat way, trying to hide out. I have a feeling you uh, weren't hiding, hiding so well. Nice job, Lydia. Nice job. Oh, man. Got a lot of good stuff on him. I didn't even realize you, buddy. You must have gotten killed almost immediately. Oh, potions galore. Yeah, the, the, yeah, the pointless. Can I just get... Oh, you know, you could even give me a coin purse that had one gold in it, and I'd be like, okay, that's fair. Because realistically, I could see either a character or an NPC being like, oh, let me, let me put all my gold in my coin purse. Plink! Or it wouldn't even plink, it would just drop in there. Banded iron armor. Wow, man. Uh, you know, I might, might, might take off this armor and put on that banded iron armor, you know. Might, might really be worth it. What do we got up here? Leather strips. I'll take it. I'll take it. I think we're... Oh, we have this little test thing to get through. I, I believe that's really it for this. I think we have this, and then I have to, like, give my blood. <laughs> give my blood over. And that's the whole challenges to get into this place. I think. Don't catch me lying. This would break. If you dropped stone like that, well, maybe if you were able to drop it slowly like that, it'd be fine, but. From that height, if you were just to let, you know, a stone slab drop like that and it hit, it would it would break. What is. Okay, this does nothing. That does something. Okay. I guess there's certain ones that are fire. Okay. Alright, okay. 
guess if you look at them, there's a certain way to cross them, but I mean, we did fine. No one died, right? Right? Esbern, Delphine, y'all good back there? Yeah, that was it. Yeah, that's, that's literally it. And then you get here with this creepy giant head that rules out of the way. And a chest stocked with some arrows and some bracers. I ain't complaining, but interesting. Esper and Delphine, y'all coming? They coming? There's Delphine. Esbern. There we go. Alright. A creepy face. Got it really, it's really creepy. I don't know whose face is supposed to be, but it's creepy. This is nice though. Oh, look at all the hanging moss I could grab. Oh, I can grab some of it. Can't grab any. Yeah, I can grab one of them. Standard dagger because I ain't got others. Hey, I should because there's loot I'm going to get. <laughs> nah, we'll listen to their RP of about this place. Come on, lady, we don't need our weapons out. Are y'all coming? There you go. Delphine? Delphine. Does he light this one, but not the first one? Oh, Delphine lit that one. I guess. Except, she doesn't have a torch. Original Akaviri bar relics. Almost entirely intact. Delphine's going around lighting them without a... Nice, Delphine. And me. You can see how the Akaviri craftsmen were beginning to embrace the more flowing Nordic style. We're here for Alduin's wall, right, Esbern? Uh, yes, of course. Mm -hmm. time to look around there, I suppose. Let's see what's up ahead. A room. Torchless Delphine. Torchless Delphine. Just pointing, pointing her. Oh man, makes no sense. I love it. Never change Skyrim. You're as buggy as anyone would want you to be. Y'all coming? We checking this out? I have time to loot whatever's in this room over here. I'm gonna loot whatever's in this room over here, which I believe. Yeah, yes, 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 yes. Uh, Lydia, you got some armor. I don't know if you like it, but you're going to get some armor. Dragonbane, I'm keeping that for sure, because I will need that, I believe. Lydia, okay, hey. I've got your back. I am sworn to carry your burdens. That's good. Huh. I guess the armor's better, but the rest ain't, because she still got played everything else. What's up here? It goes up here. It goes here. Yeah. Is that it? Okay. There's only so there's only the one side room to this place. Okay. Wait, no. This is another side room as well. That goes way down there. Okay, so this is another bigger side room. All right. I'm gonna take the hides. I ain't complaining. Oh, there's a couple chests in here. Yeah, I'm not gonna have any kids unless they're true Argonian. Well, you know, Argonians. 
I don't know if there's any Argonians you can marry in this game, but we'll find out. Man, a lot of leather in, in, in here for some reason. Come on. Don't want that. Yep. Anything in you? Oh, salt. No. Well, someone should light a fire. Y'all discovered the wall yet, or do you need me to walk up to it to activate your audio cues? You need me to walk up to it to activate your audio cues. I walked up to it, Esburn. Delphine, you got a torch finally? Let's go see if Esburn's right about all that. Isn't it amazing? Hmm? <laughs> We're here. Esburn. Hey, yo, Esburn. Don't you want to check out this wall? Ain't this wall interesting, Esburn? I'm going to... Esburn. 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 Esburn! Hey, yo, Esburn. Esburn, dog. 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 Esburn. Esburn. Look at this wall. Esburn. Esburn. I'm going to kill Esburn. Oh. Ah, of course. Not everyone has an appreciation for the artistic wonders of the world. Oh my god, I have to I have to <laughs> so lore wise so that he doesn't say anything that I don't miss, I gotta walk up to him and be like either tell him to carry on appreciating the art of this place or be like, uh, we wanna know about the dragon and that's all I care about. So you can't be like, Oh yes it is amazing, but we would need to know about the dragon right now. That's that's <sighs> Skyrim. Ah, here it is. Aldrin's defeat is the centerpiece of the plot. Uh, you see, here is fallen from the sky. The Nord Tops, masters of the voice, are arrayed. Patience, my friend. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in allegory, mythic symbolism. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. You mean they used a shout to defeat Alderaan? You're sure? Oh, yes. Presumably something rather specific. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all the news of Alduin. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. Have you ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? You're probably right. I was hoping to avoid having to involve them in this, but it seems we have no choice. If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. Mm. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the civil war or done anything about Alduin? No. And they're afraid of you, of your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? I mean... This is a Xanthar answer. Good. The Greybeards can teach you a lot, but don't let them turn you away from your destiny. You're Dragonborn, and you're the only one who can stop Alduin. Don't forget it. Right. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. <laughs> Not likely... We'll look around Skyhaven. Talos guard you. Their little cult. Did you need something? Haven't you been paying? If we can get or not, there's no. You're in luck. There is a blessing the ah. beings used on the eve of battle. I doubt the blessings. Oh, of course. Last for very long. So ask whenever you're. 
May the scales of the dragon kind splinter as it that's all there is to it, dragon. Here are the Akari. Huh, that's a cool blessing. Let's see. Oh, oh. Well, that's probably one of the longer blessings in the game. I don't know any bless I don't know many blessings that last longer than five days. So plus ten increased critical chance versus that's that's a solid blessing. <laughs> Actually, and every five days or ten days or whatever it said, but a couple days, I'll take it. Especially, I mean, most blessings are like you know, oh, until you rest, you know, a couple minutes or something, or uh, a day or whatever. But okay, anything? I don't think there's anything out here until they fix this place up. Okay, that definitely sounds like a dragon, but it's not, it doesn't sound like he's like right here. He is totally right here. Come on. Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. Oh, Lydia. This is really, buddy, you're going to make me parkour to you? Oh, God. This is how we die. This is how we die. Parkouring after a dragon. This is how we always die. Parkouring after random hanging moss. All right. I hit him. Oh, parkour after a dragon. I can't. I gotta go over there? Alright. I think I can get up over here. Dragon. Oh, he's still up there. I can totally get up right there. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Keep swimming. Keep keep walking. Come on. Alright, dra- Alright, land in. Land again. I swear if you land over there, I'll kill you. Okay, buddy. Come on. Uh, of course he gets up and flies off. All right. Don't you go over there, dog. 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 What are you doing? Can you even get a head off on you over there? Come on. No. I've always wanted to kill one when he was up on a stuck up on the roof like that see 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 if and how it would fall down all right where's my fast healing Oh, here we go. Kill shot. Why would you ever jump on top of a dragon's head? Why? Why? Yeah, just, just give an audio cue with my hand flailing towards it. You could have made these so much better by just having your character... I mean, with shield... With a shield, you could have him, like, shield bash and then, like, like do an attack and, like, throw around and stuff. But now it's just like, ah, oh, you, know, you know how I would finish a dragon? I'd jump on top of his moving head. What do we got? Nope. Lydia. Lydia, where you at? This might be Dire Straits. I don't know where Lydia's at. You know what I can do? Since I am right here, and it doesn't can count as fast travel. Oh, there's enemies nearby. Oh, and I cannot fast travel while I'm over covered. I know what I can do. I know what I can do. This should get Lydia to spawn. I'll wait. See if she show up. She show up. Oh, hey, Lydia, get up here, Lydia. There's no way you're over encumbered as well, are you, Lydia? Still here. How can I serve you, my friend? What else is heavy? Oh, that's fine. 
All right, what do you got? 21? Are you telling me that that's better? It is? Yeah, okay. Lead on. Let, let me give you... How can I serve you, my let me give you some other stuff until I am... Yeah. That's fine. I don't need the wood sword. I can pick up one when I actually want to. I can pick one up later. Alright. So first off. Okay. We're at 44. We're going to head to Markarth. And just. We either head to Markarth and take a cart back to Whiterun. So that I can trade and craft and everything between uh, episodes. Or uh, we'll go to Markarth, and that's where I'll start off next time. And I'll sell and craft stuff in Markarth. Mm. I don't want to go into Markarth yet. I want to, yeah. We'll definitely go back to Whiterun. I want to leave Markarth alone for now. But we can go back to Markarth, and I can, I can finish that quest to uh, clear out the mine, because I just did that. See, it's like the game designers, you know, expected you to... Uh, Take that, you know, fast travel to Markarth, or take the cart to Markarth, and then get that quest, and then do all of this. Interesting. Now, I'm sure they were just like, hey, there's mine just down the road from here. Clear it out. Alright, so I need... Wait, where is he? Left-hand mine. So he's to my right? What? It's not appearing on that marker, but we'll find him over here. Who am I supposed to be looking for? Pavo? Pavo? Pava. He might be in the mine. Where's Pavo? 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 Here, Pavo! Oh, now all my markers updated. Oh, he's in the barracks. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. I trust you're not finding any trouble. Volskiger mine is lost, friend. You drove them off? Thank you. Mm -hmm. we'll head back to work right away. Take care. Oh, man. That is uh, 12 and a half uh, bandits uh, that I would have killed. So nice. Divine smile on Yeah, we're just going to head back to Whiterun. Uh, might do a little hunting outside of it before I end this episode. Well, no. I think we'll just keep this episode at this length. It's fine. It's a little short, but it'll be fine. I mean, it saves y'all watching me, you know, craft and everything for a whole episode. So, we're good. All right, buddy. Back to Whiterun. All right, after this, where do we have to go? Oh, well, I have to... Yeah. So, that's... Yeah. I might take a break episode because we've been we've been we've been run down pretty pretty. Where do you want to go? White run. We're going to White Run. Climb and back and we'll be we've been doing we've been doing a lot of. Uh, we're getting the bird's nest. When I'm in White Run, I always visit the guild tree. Never hurts to pay your respects to Lady Kinneret. No, we've been doing a lot of. Uh, oh. Well, that'll be an interesting place to end my recording. Um. Skyrim just straight up crashed right on that. So, yeah, I think this will be the end of the episode. Um, I'm going to reload Skyrim and make sure it's all good. And my and it did autosave before I fast traveled. So, <laughs> that we can actually use this recording. But, dear God. Oh, Skyrim. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you, Skyrim? Who knows? Who knows? special special game all right so we're just gonna load into Skyrim and make sure our save is there <laughs> Man. yep Bethesda Bethesda Game Studios great job great job solid job on the game oh no right 
Maybe it just has it after I came out of the uh, miners' barracks, I guess. Divine smile on you, friend. I'm sending word to the Orc stronghold that you're to be trusted. Oh, nice. Orc stronghold, sir. Gonna trust me now. Okay, gamers, so we'll try once again to travel to Whiterun and then save and finish the game. Or not the game, but this episode. Oh man, let's quick save before we travel. Let's get this egg before we travel. Traveling the city of Markarth. Where do you want to go? Climbing back and we'll be off. So what I was trying to say was uh we might be taking a break from the main campaign uh next episode and doing some clearing out some of this miscellaneous stuff. Um I don't really m mind gathering up quests and stuff in my uh, quest uh, journal or log or whatever, but I do really mind the fact that... So these, I don't mind picking these up, but all these miscellaneous, yeah, we want to get rid of some of it. I mean, like, talk to Aventus, go to the design, uh, Shrine of... Like, some of these I might not do because they spawn other really long quests. I mean, Shrine of Azura, that, it's a quickish one. Um, but like, Evans Zarentino, that's the entire Dark Brotherhood quest, which we're not doing for a while, a li really long time. Investigate the Bard's College, on the other hand, it's like, I think it's one dungeon, maybe two. Uh, so, some of these, some of these will get out of the way. Some of these we won't at all. Um, so that might be next episode, otherwise we'll be headed up to the Greybeards. I will leave y'all with, uh... Perhaps you have encountered Madran or Akari. Both are sworn to me. And both have worthy goods to offer. I wonder. No. Nope. He he says they're sworn to him, but I don't I don't know if you can ask him. I don't know if you can ask him like what exactly he means by that. It might just be a contract thing and a language barrier. If you you know think about. It. All right, gamers. This is, this is where we're ending. Let's see what can we override. I'm trying to keep a couple saves backed up in case. I get into what, what is this? We can probably yeah, we can definitely overwrite that save. Okay. Always save your games, gamers. Always make sure it gets saved. Uh, like and subscribe and all that stuff. And uh, everybody, take care until I see you next time.